you welcome back in this particular video um as we normally do we'll be designing the mobile version of this how it's going to look like on mobile phone so the first thing i will do we'll come over here with let navbar and mobile so you could see that so the mobile navbar we'll also select footer as well but the mobile footer too as well so those are the two things 375 uh this should also not be more than 375 375 uh, this works so once we have these two things now the first thing i will also want to have here as you guys can see is our uh, um, breadcrumbs and okay, so i'm just going to duplicate this i'm bring it here and try to put it around here and the spacing should not be more than 20 right so i want to select this select this select this as well and add auto layout to it then add a seal to it too as well and uh ensure that this guy here is feel so that it's going to just work everything out then this height here should be like 56 all right so this is our product mobile so let's take it up so let's call this one products mobile right so this could actually this could actually be it so if we have this like this here the next thing now that we could do the next that we should have is this other one right so let's see how we can make this mobile so if we bring this here and uh we change it to become vertical like this so it looks good and um but the thing now is this other one this one here should not be like this so um on mobile we should not have a sidebar we should not have probably that particular one then we cannot have like an arrow here and um probably the height that is see let's see this height that is 650 can also be smaller right can also be smaller let's see few points in there all right so these heights can actually be smaller so let me give you 400 that's oops i need to type 400 400 all right cool because this will also not be this size so let's give this one 20 remember this is going to be 20 and this should not be more than three seven five all right cool that's what we are working with so this should also be feel like this then this inside it should also be filled too so this makes more sense right now then this one also should also be feel uh, this should also be filled too so we have this too as well so this one this works this should also be feel as well that works this guy here should probably be like this so this works too as well this is okay this is okay then the only thing now that we have right here now is this particular one so i want to add two things i want to add um a chevron or an arrow let's see a chevron work fine to chevron all right this one here left and right so let's drop it here and uh let's drop the right one let's right one let's drop it here too so these two arrows they look good but i'm going to make it like 32 i want it to be bigger so 32 and uh i will make it um absolute like this then take it to the sides then align it to the center like this cool the same thing i'm going to do with this guy too uh make it absolute uh take it to the center too as well then make it set soon all right so this is what we have so this would serve for our arrows right oops so this should actually be 32 like this too let's ensure is this question is this question is function as well all right cool so this is the hero here and everything looks good so we'll take this one and put it there so you see what we have so this is how it's going to look like on mobile so which i think it's it's great then what else so we've done here 
So the next one is this one, chisel, shield. Uh, for us to know how this will look in mobile, sometimes we need to like, we need to disassociate it from the, uh, there's that one, uh, detach instance. So we can actually just play with it a little bit. So since we detach instance, right here, we could say, let it, let it look like this. Uh, let's see how it goes. So see, this is really perfect. So let's make this 375. So it will make it 375. It's giving us this weird thing. Um, this space here should be 20. Don't worry, we'll, we'll work on it. Uh, this one here now, that used to be 50 and stuff. So this should be um, org. And um, this should be probably like 20. Let's see how that one goes. 20 seems good. Let's do the same thing here for fixed org. And uh, let it also be 20. All right. So see, that works perfectly fine. So I adjusted that one. So this other guy too. So this text here. Uh, so uh, if you remember, this one is also a component. So let's see if we could detach the instance. Detach instance. And let's see if we could adjust this. So this one uh, should be adjustable. Let's see. If I did the right thing. Detach instance, then I could adjust this last. Okay, this should be like 50 thereabouts. Okay, 50 seems really small, so let me make it 100. All right, 100 seems really great. So there's a spacing here 32. We don't want that particular spacing. So, and uh, this one here has a space here too of 40, so we could select this be 16. So I think this is great. So I'll just duplicate this twice. One, two, three. Then this one will no longer need it. We don't also need this. So but this one is just perfect. So everything looks cool. Then we'll take this and drop it here. And it looks cool too. So we need a mobile for this. But I think we already have mobile for this. So we'll just copy it from here. So I will not stress ourselves. And We'll paste it here, take it up a bit, and change it to the sort of new arrivals, changes to related products, right? Or related items. You need to want to call it related products. So this this is the mobile. So this eye is going to look like so this eye looks like on desktop and this eye is going to look like on mobile. And uh, this seems really, really great. So uh it's 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 cool. Right? So somebody and easily just come in here and buy. So another thing again that we could do, because this guy, let me let let's play this now. Let me show you guys something. Let's play this. So you see how it is. So see see how it is, right? So the one of the major important information here is the add to cart and buy now. But until you scroll down to this point before you see it. So one way that we could resolve this is to take this guy out completely and um, let us bring it out. So we'll just bring it out like this. So it's on its own. Then we don't want this particular space. So we'll give it zero. Then what, what, what we could do is to make it absolute of everything, right? So if we come over here, you see absolute here. You can just make it absolute. So now, it, that means it's going to lie on others. So let, let me put add a few. Right? So it's going to be lying on others. So let's see. 905. So it depends where you want to place it. So you want to place it in such a way. So this is where it is. So you could see it's, it's fixed there. Let's bring it up a bit. So what... It depends on the phone. Okay, let's let's use a phone. Let's use a phone position. Uh, uh, device known. Let's use uh, 375. Something like this. So this should be at 812 height. So let's see. 
So you see at 812 height, this is what we get. In front at 812 height, this is what we get. So we want that stuff to appear at 812. So we'll try to take this back. Take it up to where we get to 812. Let's see. Uh, in fact, enough for us not to stress ourselves. Let's measure it ourselves, right? Let's give this a height of 812. 812. All right, cool. So this stuff is height of 812. So this should somehow find itself around here. All right, so this should. Let me give you stuff with ticker color. I'm going to delete it. I'm using it as my measurement. All right, so it seems to be at the same line. So I can delete it now. So this is it here. Oops, still not. Okay, so now, so now that we had it that way, all we need to do now, I could even make it bigger. Right, so we need to say on that prototype now. So, this is what I will put you guys on that prototype. So, we can now say, um, scope position, um, fix, stay in it, please. So, it's fixed now. So, you see, it's fixed. So, it's not scroll no matter, um, what you're doing. So, let's take a look at it. So, you see, so it's not scroll. So, add to cut and buy now will just be there. Let's bring it, let's increase the height of this button a bit. Let's say, let's the height be like 50. Fifty makes sense. Does the height be like fifty? Uh -huh. so let's let's take a look at it now. So you see, no matter what you're doing, you're just going to be there. Let's take it up a bit. One, two, three, four, five. See, I'm using my eye. Uh, so this makes sense. So let's take it up again. One, two, just two. So everything looks nice. So. Add to cut to just look like this. By now, just look like this on mobile. So I think it's great, and I think it should look like this on mobile actually, right? So so on mobile, sometimes again you want to also want to add like a safe area, right here. So that is the reason why we add um on mobile. You can also add like your status bar somewhere around here. But you you guys got it right. So that's how it should look like on mobile. So our add to cart and buy now should actually be fixed like this. And I think like this is really, really great on mobile devices, right? So thank you guys for watching this particular video. See you guys in the next video.